Hi, I'm Celeste. If this is the first time to find your purple, then welcome. If you've been here before, then welcome back. The book I'm talking about today is a subject near and dear to my heart. I read Napoleon Hill's book, Think and Grow Rich, 30, 40 years ago, a long time ago, and I've read it a few times since. The message is still the same. And it's about the power of affirmations and the power of self-talk. But back in the day, some people poo-pooed the idea. And what they're finding today, though, is there are, is scientific evidence that it is true, which is really an exciting breakthrough. The book I'm talking about is The Power of Neuroplasticity by Shad Helmstetter, Ph.D. And it is a shows the breakthrough of the research of rewiring the brain and the actual way you can go about doing it. There was a TED Talk that I saw with a woman. The title of the TED Talk was The Woman Who Changed Her Brain, which was pretty intriguing to me. Her name was Bar Barbara Aerosmith Young, and it was a TED Talk in Toronto. And TED Talks happen all over the world, and it's about sharing ideas, and you can go on the internet and Google TED Talks, and you can find a series of subjects. There's hundreds of them out there now available to everyone. But Barbara Aerosmith Young, was a woman who was born with what they called a brain block. She could not reason things out. If it was black and, I mean, you know, concrete, black and white, one and one is two, she could memorize things, that wasn't a problem. But she couldn't understand jokes, she couldn't understand emotions, she um, really had trouble living with it. And the doctors told her that was the way it was. That was how she was wired. That was the way she was born and basically suck it up and live with it. Well, uh, she couldn't tell time because that is a concept. So anything that was conceptual, she'd get lost even in a friend's home because she couldn't understand spatial relationships. And even the left side of her, her body was kind of an enemy to her. If she had her hand on um, a hot stove, she would feel pain, but she would have no idea where it came from. So obviously part of her brain was damaged in some way. And when she was 25, she heard a story about a Russian soldier who had had a brain injury from a bullet and how he could not reason and all of that. And she recognized herself in him. Ultimately, he was able to retrain his brain. And that made her realize there was a chance for her. She started with telling time and it took her three or four months but using flashcards and going from learning the two hands and then the relationship with the third hand and the fourth hand she was able to rewire her brain to be able to tell time and once that connection was made that opened other doors to her things books she couldn't understand before she could understand and it was exciting and she it actually is being taught in some schools, and I think it has a lot of possibilities. But Dr. Shet Helmstetter brings that to the everyday man to let you understand how you can rewire your brain. They used to say you can't keep teach an old dog new tricks. Well, they're proving yes, you can if you make the effort. And it is an effort on uh, to think positive. It is an effort to change your mood. But in the book, he goes through what the logic is, what the history is, what the studies have shown, and steps you can take to re rewire your brain. So I just thought I would bring it out because I think everything on Find Your Purple begins with your belief that you can. I'm going to teach myself how to juggle. Well, actually, I'm going out trying to find somebody to teach me, but I just thought, what the heck? I've always wanted to juggle three balls, nothing fancy. And they say the more you retrain your brain to do one thing, the more it opens up other possibilities. So again, I think it's pretty exciting stuff. And if you're interested, The Power of Neuroplasticity by Shad Helmstetter. And if you know a book that changed how you think, how you feel, or helped your life in any way, then please put it below. We can share it with the group. In the meantime, grab your cup of tea, sit back, and let's start sharing. Thank you.